Welcome back to Bitsby Trip, and this is your host, Carter. Let's get into this. Over the past few days, I've been testing and configuring the 8X 5700 XT build, and I'm trying to get this first Navi 10 release of the mining kernels to work with the latest AMD drivers using Phoenix Miner 4.6C. I was trying to get some slick overclocks and memory adjustments to significantly reduce the core voltage and overall power savings. If you recall the previous video, we achieved 52 mega hash per card, just over 1900 watts for the full system for a max of 415 mega hash. In this build, the base wattage is about 133 watts when setting idle, giving us an idea of how significant the tweak settings really are when now pushing 484 mega hash at yet Yes, a thousand seven watts. That is nearly 500 mega hash at a thousand watt full system. That's some crazy efficiency for this type of setup. Now this is short lived with the stability of the settings showing some early beta issues causing a series of incorrect shares and then ultimately a blue screen with a driver crash. After many tweak and iterations to memory and work size, this is showing me that ultimately it is the basic immaturity of the device driver when being pushed past stock settings. Later this week, join me on a live Twitch stream for for further technical deep dives into this 5700 XT and other generations of GPUs while I plug them into a custom made PCIe power meter. This will allow us to see the 12 volt rel, power draw, and a riser in the six pin power setup while the GP is plugged in. This should be interesting to see on the live stream. And of course, if you can't see it live, then there'll be a recap here on YouTube. Now give me a like, share, and a subscribe, and you'll catch the next one when it drops. Peace.